All right, welcome to my October 12th live item shop review video. We're almost halfway through October. Can you believe that? We're starting out with a gift from who? Let's take a look. Ooh, that's a disgusting one, but awesome. Look at those teeth in there. Gross. I love that pink color, however. Awesome. Thank you so, so much. Uh oh, we got another gift. Who's this one from? The Pinkest Bunny. My good friend. Ooh, the Nashers. These go with Big Mouth. I wonder if that means Big Mouth is back. Look at those creepy eyes. Ooh, and that little dangly bit on the bottom. What is that? Thank you so much, my friend. I appreciate that. So what do we got with the rest of the item shop? Ooh, I like that spooky background. Wait, hold on, hold on. Let's get some Halloween music. Do we have any Halloween music? Type in howl. What? There's no Halloween music? I know I have some somewhere. Let me look. There it is, eerie. That's Halloween-y. All right, now we're set. Look at this, the Reaper is back from season one. You see someone holding this? They're a sweat, guaranteed. Nice, chance to grab it, 800. Phone, will you stop? Here's Big Mouth with his brand new secondary style. Amazing, red and black, looks phenomenal. And then the frogs turn green to blue. Blue, blue, there we go. And the eyes turn black and they were pink before. So just a clean skin. Scary, clean, Halloween-y, awesome. Here's the Nashers, and they come with a secondary style as well. I'm surprised I didn't own these. I thought I had the entire set. Ooh, look how sweet that looks. Definitely one of the creepiest. Here's the animated wrap that I got gifted as well. Thank you again. Ooh, the Zone Wars bundle. I love this bundle. This skin is underrated. You don't see too many people run it. Look at that. It's like Oblivion, the female Omega. And then Hot Zone. Man, I totally forgot about these skins. I'm going to have to put them on my presets. What's this? I don't remember this. The Flux? Oh, yeah. Okay. Nice little bundle there. You can get the Hyper Edge pickaxes as well. Look at that color scheme. Wow. I don't know if I did a review on these, but they look like they would have a wicked contrail. Two styles there, of course, as well. The Edge Factor. This is the other bundle that I was talking about. We had a similar bundle just the other day, and I referenced this. This is the one I was talking about. There's two bundles that look pretty much the same, but they're obviously different, of course. A lot of reactivity in here. I did a full gameplay review on this if you want to check it out. Oh, this is a skin I always forget about. Every time it comes back out, I say, whoa, what is this one? Look how wicked that looks. And then she's got a gas mask on, too. That secondary style is fire. Look at this. One more. Boom. Purple and black looks tremendous. I'm going to have to run that. i got to add these to my presets. Don't let me forget. Unfortunately, the back bling does not have a secondary style. And then you get a cool loading screen as well. Ooh, the Wake Rider's back. Nice. Not too shabby. Aquamarine set. Season 6. A little bit of copyrighted traversal emote there. Glitter. Looking good, gold Skull Trooper. Krabby. Not too shabby. Staff Stand, one of the best 200 V-Buck emotes in the game. Look how awesome that is. He does this wicked flip. It won't let me redo it. Come on. And then he somehow hovers on it. It's amazing. Rick Grimes bundle still here. Survivors in Arms bundle still here. The entire Walking Dead collaboration still here. All the spooky offers remain as well. Ghoul Trooper, Brainiac, Peely Bone, Skeletara, Frankenstein, Curdle Scream Leader, Punk, Patch, Jack Gordon, Hollowhead, all the accessories. If you missed my earlier item shop review on the secret update, well, it was secret. Cat's out of the bag now. The Crypt Crashers pack is here, as well as the once referenced Ultimate Reckoning pack. Wow! Awesome item shop. There you go. That's all there is to it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use, whoa, 14 days must be up. You got to re enter a code. I wish I gave you a warning. If you're supporting somebody, and it doesn't tell you like this, I mean, you're caught blindsided. So be sure to check. It does not give you any indication. I was gonna say, don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which by the way, is Tabor Time.